instructed in the city to help transport two hearts for transplant operations in Narayana Rudayale. One green uh, corridor has been created from Columbia Asia Hospital in Yeshwanpur and the second one from BGS Hospital in Uttarahali Road. Now these separate corridors were made for two ambulances to transport the hearts for a 10-year-old girl and a 40-year-old woman admitted to Narayana Rudayale. And uh, Shrija joining us now. Uh, live uh, from Bengaluru. She will be getting us an update there, but this clearly for a good cause there. Police has created two green corridors uh, in order to transport hearts to two hospitals. New lease of life would be given for two patients. One green corridor has been created from Columbia Asia Hospital in Yeshwanpur and the second from BGS Hospital in Uttarahali Road. And these separate corridors were made for two ambulances to transport the heart for a 10-year-old girl and a 40-year-old woman. Uh, who have been admitted to the Narayan Heart Institute. And uh, these are uh, visuals uh, uh, that you are being uh, shown on your television screens of uh, that entire operation that uh, took place. This was a green corridor uh, that was created uh, for two patients. Uh, Shrija now joining us with further inputs. Uh, Shrija, uh, uh, this operation of course being done for a good cause. Uh, the police uh, successfully created two green corridors to help uh, two ailing patients, one a 10-year-old girl and the other a 40-year-old woman. Well, absolutely, two patients, that is, who are admitted at Columbia Asia Hospital here in Bengaluru. They, uh, in fact, received a heart transplant. Of course, it's a new uh, re relief of what we're given to understand because remember that they have been uh, suffering from heart ailments is what we're given to understand as far as the doctors who are treating them. They have also mentioned the fact that, uh, in fact, a green corridor was just created just early this morning. That is between 8 a.m. and uh, 8.30 a.m. is what we're being told and clearly both the ambulances, two different ambulances were deputed, one from Columbia Asia from Yashanpur and the other was from the BGS hospital. Now both the ambulances were heading to just one particular hospital, this is Narayana Hridayalaya where both the patients have been admitted and both have been taken treatments because of a heart failure is what we are being told by the doctors and the donors we understand that one particular person that is the ex-staff working at Columbia Asia, she met with an accident on 10th of this month and we also understand that family members were ready to donate her organs and of course this is a new lease of life for both okay. the patients who are now undergoing a surgery at this point in time. This was a very uh, crucial time for both the patients and that is exactly we understand that the police including the traffic cops had joined hands with the doctors and there was a live monitoring of the ambulance as far as the WhatsApp is concerned so the, the police officers could keep a track mm -hmm. on as to which were the areas that especially the ambulances were traveling. We understand that they, uh, they travel nearly close to about 30 kilometers about 30 to 34 kilometers in about 29 minutes. This is on Nice Road and we understand there was huge traffic congestion but definitely for a good cause. Absolutely, for a good cause there. Shrija, also for the benefit of our viewers, throw some light on what exactly is the Green Corridor, what challenges are faced by the police forces to create it and why is it so crucial to transport organs especially. Well, as far as the planning of uh, the traffic officials are concerned, remember this was very crucial because the heart, the, both the organs were supposed to reach in time because uh, both the patients, it was an emergency situation. They had to immediately undergo a surgery and that is exactly why they had planned, including along with the doctors, as to what was the right time uh, to transfer the organs, especially from both the Columbia Asia Hospital and as well as the BGS Hospital. And of course, they were, uh, they were in time, in fact, to also remove the organs from the donor uh, patients, what we have been told by the doctors and it was very uh, crucial at that point in time to stall the traffic and to give a green corridor. Uh, of course they had to uh, traverse through nearly uh, six to eight signals they had to uh, clearly pass through because on normal days if you're looking at nearly mm -hmm. 30 kilometers you just cannot even imagine reaching in a matter of 29 minutes so you can only imagine how what kind of a effort that was put into as far as the traffic police is concerned to cover about 30 to 40 kilometers in a matter of 29 minutes. Absolutely.